All right, y'all, it's about that time to get into these old school trailers, horror trailers, you know what I'm saying? I won't really consider this a horror movie. It's more like on a gruesome side, you know what I'm saying? If you don't have a, like a stomach for slime and creepy crawling type shit, then this not for you. It's an old time classic, one of my favorites, The Blob. The 1988 trailer, throwback trailers. I told you that's all I do is throwback trailers, you know what I'm saying? I want people to experience watching a trailer with me for the first time. If you have not seen these trailers, because I have not seen these trailers. I was, you know, I was, what, 10 during that time? Yeah, I think I was 10, so I didn't too much know anything about the blob. As I got older, I got into it, you know what I'm saying? Became one of my favorite horror classics. Me and my brothers, I always would say that because me and my brothers did a lot together. We watched a lot of shit together growing up. And this was one of them. So without further ado, y'all, let's just jump on the block. And it's a girl up in here that I had a crush on. She's starting a lot of movies. I had a crush on a lot of females back in the day, for real. From TV shows to movies, it's just nonstop. How many girls I had a crush on. <laughs> but she's one of them. I don't really know what her name is, but... I know she starred in a lot of movies. She was like a 80s man. All a uh, man wanted this girl. Well, if you was a kid, you know what I meant to say. But let's get into this, y'all. 1988, The Blob. One of my favorite actors is up in this. He starred in a TV show. I ain't gonna even give it away. I'm gonna let y'all guess what TV show he starred in. It's a very, very successful TV show. That went on, I believe, for seven or eight seasons. A lot of cursing, a lot of nudity, a lot of sex. It was a crazy show. It starts with an E. I'm going to go with that. I'm going to end with that, actually. So let's go. He has a brother in Hollywood, too, and he's very he's a very successful, accomplished actor. In his own right. But you ought to know who I'm talking about when you see it. Let's go. If it had a mind, you could reason with it. If it had a body, you could shoot it. If it had a heart, you could kill it. But it didn't have none of those things. Now, man is no longer the supreme being on this planet. The organism is growing at a geometric rate. By all accounts, it's at least a thousand times its original mass. Nobody believes me about what happened tonight. What did happen? You were there, you saw. Ask me, life form that haunts its prey. Predator. I want that organism alive. I think you ticked it off. The blob. Terror has no shape. All right, there you go. Classic blob. So his name is, I believe, Kevin Dillon. His brother, Matt Dillon, is also a famous movie star. You know, I don't understand why Kevin Dillon ain't become, like, big like Tom Cruise Tom, and Tom Hanks and all these big A-listers because he's been doing movies a long time. And he's a great actor. I love him in The Entourage. If y'all have not seen The Entourage, please start watching that show. It is one of the best. For real, one of the best. And he stole every scene, my opinion, once again. But, I, you know, I'm a big fan of Kevin Dillon, and I don't understand why he didn't become big. Just like uh, Michael Bean from Terminator, that's another guy who should have became big, but he didn't. He's just an ordinary movie star. He's not one of these huge A-listers that's making $15, $20 million a film, in which he should be, but he's not. Same with Kevin Dillon. 
But that girl, I don't really, I don't know her name, but she is she was so beautiful, to, you know, to me back in the day, and just seeing her now just made me feel some type of way, you know, nostalgia. It's a motherfucker for real. But the Blob, it it was a crazy ass movie. Crazy ass movie for real. I think the part in that movie I didn't like was when that little uh, that young boy was killed. I think he was like thirteen or fourteen years old, and uh, he had a friend who actually started the movie who lived, but he ended up dying. And it was crazy the way he died. You all have to check the movie out to know what I'm talking about. I ain't gonna give nothing away if you have not seen that movie yet. But that's the uh, original blob. Well, that's actually not the original blob. It was a blob that came out before that. I didn't watch that one you know what i'm saying I, I don't go back that damn far when it comes to movies like that you have to you have to really be a classic like a west side story or movies like that that really like it really just catch me but the blob the i believe it was the 1950s blob 1960s blob no i i'm sorry i can't i can't do that one ain't no way no how that's just not me it's not for me y'all but hit me up in the comments and let me know what y'all think. If you uh, watched The Blob, what was your favorite part in The Blob? Who was your favorite actor in The Blob? It was actually a few actors up in there that became famous over time. And it was a few actors in there that were acting for decades. Like I said, I'm not real good with their names. But uh, yeah, it was a great movie. Fun movie. Fun movie. I won't consider it a great movie. I'll take that back. It was a fun movie. It wasn't scary. It was gruesome. So hit me up in the comments and let me know what y'all think. And as always, thank y'all for tuning in. Until next time, peace, love, and deuces.